It all started with a legend. Two friends, Carl and PM, will traverse the packs of Yu-Gi-Oh's past, opening 24 booster packs of each core set from the first to the latest, building a deck with their pulls and improving upon them and their strategies as they progress forward through the set list. The winner gets the chance at great prizes with our winner's wheel, but the loser gets a chance to make a comeback, getting a ban and their own wheel to spin. Come aboard and set sail with us upon the D-Ships. I, uh, don't like being the one that's here all of the time now. Not all of the time. I don't like it two in a row. The series is now tied up. I am not happy about that. I'm very not happy about that. Uh, we're going back to this wheel. I'm going to pray for something good. Please, God, if I can get a Jinzo, if I can get an Ultra or above to grab a Jinzo. Oh, there's no above on this. I forgot. Fuck me. Let me get an Ultra for a Jinzo, please. <sighs> Copycat. What cards do PM have that I want? I could take Change of Heart, which is not bad. Fuck me, I don't know what PM has. Yeah, fuck it. I think I will just take uh, the copy of a uh, of uh, change of heart. Matter of fact, I'm pretty sure we'll just go with that. I do uh, and do I do enjoy a nice change of heart. Good morning, and welcome back to another episode of D Ships. I am currently, believe it or not, on a winning streak. I'd like for that to continue, but before we get into that, time for me to spin my winner's wheel. I'll take it. See you in the polls. All right, we're opening today 24 packs of Labyrinth of Nightmare. This uh, this packs. I mean, hey, I just saw the Torrential. I was about to say it's not great, and then I saw Torrential, and that's actually pretty good. Uh, Gemini Elf and Magic Cylinder Secret are pretty good. Gemini Elf's uh, one of the strongest normal vanillas we'll get for a hot minute, I'm pretty sure. And Magic Cylinder is just uh great for redirecting damage. That's a a great card to have. Uh, Torrential, of course one of the biggest ones just wipe the fucking board completely great card uh what does united we stand do again that monster gains 800 attack defense for each face up monster you control that's not terrible that could be worse shout outs to the last warrior from another dimension destroy all of the monsters you control only the player can summon monsters oh actually that's pretty funny yeah, we've got a lot of things. We've got the masks mostly. This is where the masks came into play. The card is safe for turn. The masked beast. Masked beast, if you couldn't tell, doesn't do fucking anything. He's a 3200 beat stick. That's that's all he's good for. The other player can tribute cards. That's just funny. We could do if we pull enough masks that are good, we could do a mask lockdown. Of course we have fairy box in this. Pim's definitely going to be running that, and Vengeful Bog Spirit if he's going to go back to the burn strategy. Fusion Gate is a very good card for later on, especially like the GX era, where we can get uh, fusions out a little easier. It'll help PM too, unfortunately, but we can definitely now start going with uh, with some fusion strats, although we won't be able to get back uh, banned cards for a hot minute. This, of course, also has Bazoo the Soul Eater and Kaiku the Ghost Destroyer. Jar of Greed, because at this point, Pot, I think, was banned, if not a little earlier than this. The Defusion, which is just funny. Just a really funny card. I forgot what these masks do. Mask of Dispel, I think, is just a face up spell card in the field. Control the spell card takes 700 points of damage during each stand by phase. Yeah, okay. It's just uh, as long as the card is up, it's just more burn. Equipped monster can't attack. Inflict 500 damage to the equipped monster's controller. Yeah, some of these masks are all right. They're pretty cool. This one is an equip that increases a thousand attack, decreases defense. Pay a thousand life points to destroy the card. Yeah, that's good for like one turn, just about. 
Yeah, some of these are pretty right. Of course, we have the, the spirit boards, the spell death, except in Japan, they spell final. So you get spirit message L, but it's an H in the picture and it's very funny. Uh, I don't think there's anything worth note in the commons necessarily. I guess some of the I get Amazonist Archer, I guess. I don't know. Some of these aren't that that great necessary. Summoner of Illusions is pretty funny. Uh, I don't know if any of these besides like Zombira matter. Zombira is good because he's a 2100 beater but he can't attack directly. So he's just a body on the field. But yeah, so without further ado, let's get into these polls. Okay, 24 packs, Labyrinth of Nightmare. I don't really know what I want from this, but as long as we get things that can help us make a better strategy or win a little better, I'm fine with it. We got Empress Holiday. We got a fairy box already. That's pretty cool. Spiritualism. What the hell do these two do? Return spell trap card and your opponent controls to the hand. Activation and effect can't be negated. That's not bad at all. Negate all equip cards on the field. Those are just funny. Those two are just very funny cards. Biomage? No. I was about to say he's all right, but his attacks do do. Pack number two. Mask of Dispel. All right. That's pretty good. Tornado Wall. That's good if we have... Oh, we do have Umi, don't we? I have some interesting strategies. Forgiving Maiden. I forgot about you. Maybe this face-up card return to your hand. One of your monsters destroyed as a result of battle during this turn. That's not good. That's... I mean, that's fine. That's all right. Pack three. What do we got? Spirit of the Breeze. Got the Curse of the Mass Beast. We can play Mass Beast if we get it. I forget what all of these cards do. What the fuck do any of these do? All right, Lady Sailor of Flames seems to be the only good one, and that's because she's just part of a burn strategy. So that's, you know, that's just how it be sometimes. Fire Sorcerer, I'm pretty sure she's good for that too. Infinite Cards is just funny. Just flat out funny. I just realized we got some offerings to the Doomed. I'm pretty sure those are pretty good cards also. Um, Jowgen the Spiritualist. Humanoid Drake Worm. Ugh. Super Rare Fire Princess. Okay. All right. Um, each time you gain life points, inflict 500 to your opponent. I mean, I'm getting some, some, some burn stuff. Kind of. Isn't rock spirit good for some things? You must be special summoned from your hand by banishing one earth monster from your graveyard. Gains 300 during your opponent's battle phase only. And not really. All right. 24 packs of Labyrinth of Nightmares starting right now. Um... The Dark Door is fantastic for me. I'm probably probably going to end up playing Stall again. Stall, Mill, Burn, whatever. Uh, so the Dark Door is fantastic for me. Um, if I can pull off all of the letters, I will try all of the letters. But until then, uh, Hysteric Fairy is another beater. Garuda is just a, a special summon to get onto the board. Nothing too fantastic. Okay, hey, this, this is a pretty good pack. Fairy Box, fantastic. Jam Defender, might be okay, depending if I pull the slime. Uh, Gillosaurus is fantastic. The Last Warrior from Another Planet. I have seen so many fucking combo videos where it's just, the final piece of the puzzle is just this, to stop my opponent from doing anything. I won't be able to pull it off today, but one day, maybe I can have fun with this, but not not today. Jam breeding machine, okay. Offerings to the doomed. Is this good? Tiger one face. Yeah, that's that's pretty okay. That is pretty okay. There's another letter. Blind destruction. I remember playing this back in the day. Same level as the dice roll. Six destroy all level six or higher monsters out on the field. We're kind of in the era of just playing level between level three to six, maybe with the occasional seven or eight. So I, I don't think I'll be playing it as funny as it would be. All right, two letters down, three to go. Another Gillosaurus is fantastic. This could be good. Yeah, it just stops your opponent from tacking. 
and then gets destroyed after two turns. Okay. All right, we'll think about it. It's another stall option. Um, Zombri is is pretty good. Uh, there. Okay. Okay. Listen. One was enough. One was enough. I don't need another warrior. It is incredibly funny, though. <laughs> it is incredibly funny. Another Zombri is fantastic. Another fairy box. And my third letter. Okay. This is getting funny. I need the trap, though. I need the trap in the last letter. And I'm pretty sure the only spell and trap removal that Carl has is... It's just seven tools of the bandit, from what I remember. Uh, okay, I there's my third Zombri. Vengeful Box Spirit is a fantastic soul card. And uh, I believe this was the other material that I needed for uh, Warrior of a Last Planet. Okay. Okay, don't get too giddy, Pum. You're not even halfway through the fucking full pulls yet. Uh, another Vengeful Box Spirit, all right. Okay. Now that's just ridiculous. <laughs> now that's just ridiculous. You can... Okay. All right. Is this a sign? Is this a sign from the heavens to be like... Just be a bastard. <laughs> I mean, I, I already have been the series. I can do it again. I have no problem in doing so. Uh, Jam breeding machine. Okay. Nothing too special here. Revival Jam. Okay. Okay. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe. Maybe. I'm having a lot of fun right now. I don't know if you could tell. Did I have that letter? Oh, fuck. I don't remember now. Fuck. I really don't remember now. Shit. Uh, I don't remember if I have that letter. Fuck. Fuck, I should have been keeping track. Shit. Uh, Bait Doll, I remember being okay. Target one set card uh, and spell a trap zone. Reveal the target. Force its activation if it's a trap. Then negate its effects if the timing is incorrect. If you do, destroy it. Okay. Uh, I still don't think Carl is trap heavy, so I don't think I'm going to get any use out of this. But we'll think about it. Tornado Wall is also very funny. I don't remember how many Umis I have. Alright, we got a Fusion Gate. We got another Mask of Weakness. A lot of these cards have not been good. I'm just gonna say. A lot of these have been Diarrhea Doggy Doo Doo, and I'm not excited about... Can this site, like, load a little faster? What the hell? Uh, yeah, a lot of these haven't been good. <laughs> All right, we've gotten some uh, some Vengeful Bog Spirit, and we've gotten a uh, Tornado Bird, which seems to be all right. Summoner of Illusions, again, is still pretty cool. Um, there's some things we can do so far. I haven't been talking through a lot of these because I'm just like flipping them and going, these suck, I don't care. Uh, Mask of Brutality is pretty good. We've gotten a couple Fusion Gate. I think we might have a place at a Fusion Gate already, which is good for later. Maybe even now, depending. Oh, if we didn't have a playset before, we have a playset now. I have a playset of Nuvia the Wicked. Hey, that card's really cool. It's dog shit. You want to see how bad this card is? It can't be normal summoned. You destroy it if it's normal summoned. If your opponent controls a monster, decrease its attack by 200 for each monster in your opponent's field. What a bad card. Fucking, what do you, come on, dog. Ooh, Mask of Restricts. That's not bad. I like that. Another Vengeful Bog. What does Miracle Dig do again? Uh, five or more monsters you are currently moved from play or turn three to the graveyard. That's not... That's not terrible. There's some things we could do with that. Can I get a Torrential, please? No, Destruction Punch again. Uh, I would I would love at least one Torrential Tribute. I think that would be amazing. No, all right. We get another another Fusion Gate and we get a Geosaurus. It's fine. It's okay. I think Hysteric Fairy is worth talking about, but I don't remember. It might not actually. It might be a joke. I don't think I have enough of the spirit messages. I have more than enough fusion gates. You could stop giving me fusion gates. Again, I would love a cylinder, a Gemini Elf, or a Torrential Tribute. 
I mean, I might actually, I might actually have all of the spirit boards. I think, actually, no, I don't think I pulled a D. All right, we got, are you kidding me? We got defusion, really? We got the defusion. I'm not re-rolling this. This isn't worth re-rolling. Um, sure, dog. This is what we've got. I'm sure PM got two torrentials, magic cylinder, and uh, I, don't, I don't even, where's the other one? Probably got last warrior. And he's going to do that. He probably got dark necrofear and mage power. I don't know. We got mask of restricts. Whatever, dog. Let's just fucking, let's just fucking get in there. Um, Tornado Bird is okay. This is basically just uh, a baby giant true knight. Oh, but it's flip. Mm -hmm. We might we might have a slot for it, maybe. Ooh, the spiritualist is good later. Not not particularly right now. Uh, discard one random card from your hand to the graveyard. Destroy all special summon monsters on the field. Neither player can special summon. Yeah, it's pretty good. Just not right now. We're not very uh, special summon heavy at the current moment. Fire Princess and Fire Sorcerer. Remind me what you two do. Each time you gain life points, inflict 500 to your opponents. Would be good in a row, mages. That's very far away now, though. Uh, randomly select two cards from your hand. Remove them from play to inflict 800 points of damage to your opponent's life points. Eh. I mean, if I'm going burn, then maybe. Rock Spirit's okay. Okay, am I at... I think I think that was the last letter that I was missing. That's not the trap. I think I might have all the letters now. Fuck, what rarity is the trap? I don't, I don't know. All right, final pack? Yeah. Hmm... Eh. Okay. Unfortunately, I did not get the D in death or the F in final. But, uh, yeah, my pulls are pretty fucking funny. Oh, I still have an ultra to pick out. Ultra, pick any ultra or blow card from the previous pack. The previous pack. The previous pack. Okay. The previous pack. Ultras. 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 These are some pretty decent ultras. Oh, PM, don't do it. Don't do it. Oh, it'd be so... It'd be so fucking funny if I did this. No, you know what? I'm gonna go... I'm gonna go with the safe bet. I am picking Chain Destruction as my ultra that I will add to my deck. Chain Destruction from Pharaoh Servant. There we go. So we're also, for this episode, uh, this was kind of a last second decision here. Uh, we're also gonna be opening uh, three packs of Tournament Pack 1, which, you know, the only really good thing in here is Mechanical Chaser. I guess White Hole would be good if we had it. What the hell's Rime? Oh, it's just a, a burn card, except it doesn't say inflict, it just says decrease. That's weird. That's wild. Oh, uh, yeah, there's some things here that I don't know how good. Yo, Bean Soldier. Yo, Shining French. Okay, I lied. This is actually a really good pack. Holy shit, Wing Dragon Guardian of the Fortress number two. He exists, he's real. But we're also going to be opening three packs of tournament pack number two, which means, I don't know, actually. <laughs> I don't think any of these are good either. The PM was like, well, I want to get all the cars in there. So let's get a look at some, what we can uh, can get. Like, okay, we can get these, <laughs> we can get Paradragon, you know? What the fuck? I mean, sure. Some of these are all right, I think. Let's take a look at some of these attacks on some of these monsters that are in here that are level four. I think I think they're mostly all 1600 attack point monsters. Beautiful Headhunter, 1600. Uh, Giant Red Sea Snake, 1800. Okay, actually not bad. 
A two headed King Rex, 1600. Maiden of the Moonlight, 1500. Calling Dragon number two, 1600. Water Magician, 14. Bird of the Books, 14. Faith Bird, 15. Takuhi! Yeah, no, not great necessarily. What we would want is pretty much Giant Red Sea Snake and that other one that I saw that I forgot already. Yo, but my man Garuzis is in here and everyone loves Garuzis. I guess, I don't know. I don't know why PM wants us to pull these. I guess because he wants a Morphing Jar, which is, of course, the best card in this pack, actually. Like, it, uh, sure. So we're going to pull them. Alrighty, three packs of Tournament Pack 1. Let us see what we get. Are you fucking yanking my chain, bro? <laughs> okay. All right. Hey, yo, Winged Dragon, Guardian of the Fortress number two. That's huge. I cannot believe that I fucking got the Mechanical Chaser. That's so funny. What the fuck is Cockroach Knight? Attention to the Great Fair, return to the top of the... Okay, all right, never mind. Sure, that's literally the best it could have been. Tournament pack one. What do we want from here? It's just Mechanical Chaser. That's pretty much all what we want from here. Bunch of garbage. Bunch of... There... Yeah, all right. I'm a god. I'm just a god. It's just that fucking easy. All right, last pack. One more? No. Winged Dragon Guardian the Fortress number two, though. It's important. And now three packs of tournament pack two. Let's see what we get from the... Yo, we got the Garuzis. That's good. I like him. He's funny. We got uh, nothing good. And... Exile of the Wicked. Yeah, none of these are really good or worth it. Tournament pack number two. Now this, this is where some of the good shit is. So I did not pick three packs. My oldest. Okay, there we go. Tournament pack two. Here we go. No, Garbo. Even more garbage. Anything? Anything? I got fucking Garuzis. Does it, this at least have the Joey text? No, it doesn't. It doesn't. It's trash. Man. All right, I don't feel crazy confident about this deck, but this is what we're going with. Uh, it seems to be relinquished turbo featuring tunes. So, Here's the, here's a little breakdown for you. All right. So we got the Cosmo Queen and the Trihorn Dragon because there are two strongest monsters that need two sacrifices. They're very powerful, very powerful, stronger than anything PM has, I believe. Uh, we just pulled the Mechanical Chaser. So Mechanical Chaser's in here because he's 1850 and we could search him off of Witch, which is wild, by the way. I was going to say we could probably search him with Tomato, but no, that's not true. It has to be attack. 1500 less attack. It's disgusting. The Sky Scouts, because they're basically uh, seven colored fish, 1800 attack. Also searchable off of a uh, witch. We've got uh, the Akumadors for defense. Uh, Thousand Eyes Idol, because you need them for the, the restrict. Toon Summon Skull as our basically big one sacrifice beater. It was difficult to get rid of. Uh, he can't attack when he's special summoned, and I have to pay 500 every time I attack with him. So if PM's doing burn again, I'm just fucked. Uh, we have no form of back row removal, except for, you know, PM's giant true need, which means it's going to be hard for PM to get rid of Toon Summon Skull unless he draws the out, which he honestly might. The Jirai Gumos, because they're still 2200 level 4 beaters, even if they decrease our life points in half half the time. At least one Dark Elf with one on the side, because I had her in the main and then switched her out for Mechanical Chaser, because I mean, Mechanical Chaser. I honestly might change this around again and add that other Dark Elf in just to have a 2000 body on the field. I don't know. We got Mystic Tomato for searching to get out Witch of the Black Forest, because, you know, we're going to use her to go into pretty much fucking everything, especially Relinquished. We need to pray that we draw the polys 
and the Thousand Eyes Idol and the Relinquish to get out Thousand Eyes. Because then Thousand Eyes is the only thing on the field that can attack. And it'll just shut down PM's board. And that's great. We have Senju, of course, to get to Relinquished. So we can just use Relinquished if we want to. The Cyber Jar, which we're still going to have to worry about on PM's field, which is unfortunate. Uh, four star ladybug because it can destroy all of the four monsters mask of darkness magician of faith to get back traps and spells respectively pm's copy of change of heart which we've taken a copy of so we can use that for relinquished for any of our sacrifices that we need all of that stuff three poly the delinquent duo the two pot share the pain swords tribute monster born black illusion literal tomb world michizure which I, I don't know if we got no we did have this last time good monster removal is, oh, you destroyed one of my monsters from some way? Is it straight up field to graveyard? Fucking destroy a monster on your opponent's side of the field. Or destroy any monster, actually. It's, it rules. Mask of Weakness, one of the new ones. He's 700. Uh, seven tools. Why not? Magic Drain, why not? We kind of need those. Uh, the only form of back row removal other than that we have is Tornado Bird. Which is just... Bounce two Speller Traps on the field to the hand and remove trap because I don't think we have any D spells. I'm pretty sure that there's no such thing as D spell that we have. No, I'm looking in my, I have D fusion. I have one D fusion. I have no D spell. I should probably throw in stop defense also, but like there's so many cards already. <laughs> Maybe I'll cut a mask of weakness for a stop defense. Or maybe a stop attack. I don't know. Those are still good cards to have, but I kind of just want to go big damage. On uh, the side, we have Sonic Birds in there also. I figured we kind of don't need the ritual spell part as much as the monster part, considering we want to make Thousand Eyes restrict. So it doesn't matter whether or not we get relinquished on the field. Uh, I already mentioned these. Offerings to the Doomed because it's just a free monster destroy, except you skip your next draw phase. So it's not terrible. Ibikyo Drachmord, equip. Equip monster can't attack, destroy the equipped monster at the end of its controller's second turn. It's not bad, necessarily. And of course, the two IO, in case we want to run IO for some reason. Um, I'm probably still going to be workshopping this after I stop recording this, honestly because uh, this has been a nightmare list to put together, but I, I'm i just kind of hoping that it fucking works. We get good hands and that we can stop PM's reign of tyranny. Okay, and here is the deck. Um, I've decided to choose violence. I've decided to continue being a bastard to Carl. That's it. I like not much of the deck has changed. Uh, I've uh, I've I've thrown in a wall that is a uh, Zombri the Dark uh, to block his like eighteen hundred beaters, and even if he has like some fucking random field spell to buff them, that this should hopefully stop him long enough. That's really the only new monster change here. I threw out Muka Muka. Uh, in terms of uh, my spells, I just threw in the Dark Door and uh, Vengeful Bog Spirit. Uh, traps, I threw in one Fairy Box and my Chain Destruction. That's pretty much it. My extra deck, I threw in my three Warriors. And in my side deck, I have the um, the other uh, material that I need, and a Poly. And, and some uh, stall slash removal options. But that's it. That's the fucking deck. I want to win because if I win, this is my third win in a row. And you know what that means? You know my rule? Oh, you don't know my rule. My rule is if it's three times, it's every time. I need this third to win for it to be every time. And hopefully with this deck, it's going to be every time. See you in the games. Hi, Carl. You ready for another exciting week of dueling? You know, this breaks our initial tiebreaker. Uh, it's two It's two apiece. Yeah, it's two apiece. Do you know what that means? It means that I can't let you win this one. <laughs> I'm never going to hear it, the end it, of it. it. It means if I win, it's every time. Uh, no, I mean, no, because there was two before that, but... But I just, I won the latest two. Mm-hmm. 
So if I win today, it's every time. You know the rule. And so do I. All right. Full commitment's what I'm thinking of. Uh, let's see. How about this one? Okay. All right. How about this one? I hey, fucking... I never lose. What the I fuck? Never this lose. is oh. Okay, let's see. Uh, let's go first. Okay. Okay. Oh, this hand could have been a lot better. I'll set one. Set two. Set three. And it's all yours. That draw could have been literally fucking anything. Um. I mean, it really could have. You have... You had 37 cards in your deck. Oh, someone sent you with a thousand Ooh. hands. Ooh. Ooh, no. Um, how about we grab ourselves one of these? Oh, sick. Um, yeah, I can't do anything else. Awesome. Well, I can't attack you directly with Zombri, so I'll go ahead and summon a funny little tomato, and uh, I'll attack you directly. Before we got in this, I was just like, yeah, I hope I get really good hands, and the first hand I get is doo-doo dog shit diarrhea. Oh, cool. Sick. You're still on this. That's fine. That's awesome, actually. I can't fucking do anything else. Mm, let's see. Are you fucking serious right now? No, I thought you had a response to that. I was about to scream. Dog. Oh, not the young Polly. Surely you have more. I do, but that's, okay, that's good. fucking disgusting, actually. It's all yours, bud. I never noticed that there's text all over Zombre. He's got like his own logo. Okay. The original E hero. Oh. I'm gonna actually change of heart. Damn. Damn. Okay. I'm gonna can't attack directly. Oh, yes, you're right. I can't uh, use my share the pain, by the way. So I just wasted this card, actually. Fine. <laughs> I'm sorry. That's fine. Hey everyone, how's it uh, going? You can tell that I just sort of woke up. If it makes you feel better, I'm sleep deprived. Uh, I hope I'm, you fucking die in your sleep. Uh, yeah, sure, fine. Fuck it, why not? Are you really still doing this burn shit? I mean, I barely burned you last time. You, you you barely burned me last time when you won with Burns. You barely burned me at all. No, I I won with Mill last time. Hmm. Complete difference. Yeah. Oh, cool. A yeah, complete difference. It doesn't help that I'm literally getting fucking nothing. Uh, fuck it. Okay. You're the pain. Ah, uh, right. Yes. That's literally all I have. Uh, well, this is unfortunate because uh, I'm kind of out of monsters at this point. So go ahead. That draw does not help in the fucking slightest. Not at all. Okay. Yeah, this isn't helping. Are you still really running fucking burn? Carl... I don't know what to tell you, bud. I don't have a good attack power. <laughs> I am very in in dire straits right now. You can play literally fucking anything, dog. No, I literally... Okay, you want me to play fucking Umi and Tornado Wall? Because that's that was my other option. 
Oh, I can. Okay. Hmm? Oh, sent to the graveyard after being flipped face up. Okay, cool. I did not read that. Well. All right. That doesn't quite help, but sure. 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 I agree. You fool! You've attacked my four-star ladybug of doom! Oh. Oh, I see. Okay, then. Um, well, go ahead. I was expecting you to do literally anything else besides this deck. Oh, that's me, Toon World. Oh, okay. Uh, I'll also activate the Link with Duo. Oh. Oh, okay. Damn. Damn. Sick. Um, that's all I got. Um... Kind of in a shit pickle right now. Yeah, fuck it. All right. <sighs> it begins. God damn, just give him the whole fucking gambit, why don't you? Jesus. Seriously? Oh, okay. Are you fucking serious? <sighs> Man, this is really fun. This is a really fun and interesting game that we're playing. I'm glad that I get to do this two weeks in a row, PM. It is. It's a game of wits. It's really not at all, actually. I want to get rid of that Morphing Jar number two. Oh, which one is it? Is it the left or the middle? Ooh, incorrect. <sighs> well, I mean, it doesn't matter. You're going to burn me to death with... All right, sick. Thanks. I hope your fucking leg gets caught in an elevator at work and you fucking die. It probably will. Ooh, that is unfortunate. Yay, now it's actually burned. Yeah, it's literally not... Okay, go fuck yourself. Hey, I, I didn't... I didn't get to... Play Skull Invitation. I didn't get to play Skull Invitation. Yeah, all right. Shut up. It doesn't matter. I'll go first. Oh, Christ, this hand. Okay. Um, I want to know what you have. Ah, hmm, I see. Just using it right off well, the bat. Yeah, sure. And you're running the fucking fairy box. Hey, if it helps, I only have one. <sighs> God almighty. I don't know why I put that one in face-up attack. I'm not going to lie, Chief. Okay, let's... Let's... Let's do... That. Why not? You really need more cards in your hand? Sure. Oh. 
Um, I'm like you go minus one either way. Sure, I will. Ooh, okay. Um. That. Yeah, that was a shame. I could have gotten that magic dream back immediately. And instead, I fucked up. One, two, three. Uh, oh, it's so fun having no backer removal. It's so fun dealing with this. This is such a fun duel to have. Think about it this way, Carl. I'm not going to think about it anyway, actually. Okay, then. Well, I was just going to suggest, eventually, when you get... Uh, uh, when you spin your loser's wheel again, you can... Um... Ban every burn card for a burn deck? Yeah. Uh, I mean, yeah, you could. Can I do the rest of my turn? Uh, yeah, fine. That doesn't trigger which does it? I don't know. I don't remember. It does. It does. As long as she hits the graveyard, it triggers. Now you see. I have tough decisions to make. <sighs> yeah, I'll grab the setup. Ooh. Okay. And then I'll just swing in. Uh, sure, why not? Yeah. My one copy of Seven Tools would be great to have, but... Well, hey, it went through. Damn it. Um, hmm. Uh, yeah, fuck it. Let's try. Oh. Activate polymerization to get out Thousand Eyes Restrict. Okay, then. Fuck that. Why did that not work? Huh? Pardon? I don't know, but that was funny. <laughs> Destroy all cards. Oh, okay. It's just in the hand in the main deck. Okay, I see now. I see now. Okay, well, I fucked up. Yeah, that was pretty funny. Uh, I'm going to end my You're turn right. there. Okay. Well, let me get this off the fucking field so it stops annoying me. Uh, will I pay for Fairy Box? Sure. Hmm. Oh, this sucks. Oh, this is awful now, actually. Wow, that kind of fucked me. Huh. It's alright, um, I can only attack with Thousand Eyes Restrict now. Really? It's the only monster in the field that can attack. Uh, that still doesn't help me. Oh, I also realized other monsters in the field cannot change their p battle positions. Right. Um, okay. Uh, it's all you, Chief. So, uh, yeah, let's just, uh, see what that is. I'm sure it's going to be Cyber Jar. Uh, heads. Nice. Oh, it's the other jar. That's fine also, I guess. Oh, right. It sends them back to the deck. Oh, cool. There goes my change of heart and my remove trap.
so we'll pay for fairy blocks. Okay. Uh, let's flip this bad boy up. I guess I'll just swing into this one. It's unfortunately my mechanical chaser. Nice. Main phase. I will set, and it's all you. I mean, also normal summon Dark Elf. Come on. Hey, show me heads. Hell yeah. No. Come on! <laughs> Yay! It's so fun not being able to play the game this early on. Cool, all right. This? Oh, I should have gripped my wall, that's fine. <sighs> Still not what I wanted. But that's fine. Uh, I'll summon Witch. And we'll go for some baby damage. It's it's not baby damage when I'm this low on life points to me. That that is true. But, that is true. You know, a remove trap right now would be fucking amazing to draw. I have three of them in this fucking deck and one got discarded. Doesn't help if I die this turn. It's gonna fucking normal summon Mystic Tomato. Okay. I could have went in and attacked with one of those. I'll have to do my rush recklessly. Oh, come the fuck on. Okay, fine. Uh, well. Go ahead and do that. I'll do that. And I'll do one of these. And that's it. Well, I gotta know what your mystery card is. It could be anything, even a cyber jar. Sangan, I see. Um, let's see, what is the deck size right now? I'm one card short. Uh, ooh, yeah, let's go ahead and grab a tomato. Main phase two. Set a card of my own. And I'll end the turn. Pot. We gotta limit pot. Uh, I agree. It's a good thing episode. This is episode five, right? So yeah. Start limiting shit. I will summon tomato. Mm hmm I will switch this to attack. Mm hmm I will swing with tomato. I'll activate my tomato. I'll also activate my Machisa Ray. Ah, okay, cool. Uh, yeah. Is this really all I fucking have left? Wow, okay. Um, tomato it is. 
And, uh... Let's go ahead and find a flame charge. I will get... What am I fucking add in my hand is the thing. I guess my biggest beater that I don't need to sacrifice anything for. Phase I will set. I will set. And I need to get rid of one more. I will set. <sighs> that does not really help that much. Um. I'll summon my Sky Scout. I will summon my Magician of Faith. I want to get this. Destroy that fairy box. Oh no. You still have tomato targets? Oh wow, Sangan. Yeah, so still have still have the young Sangan. <laughs> Let me tell you, Swords of Revealing Light would have been good also to get. Um You gonna set your that, cyber jar? That um You gonna summon Zombiro? That, that Mr Mr. Scout is a, a bit of a problem at the moment. Mm-hmm. Um, no, I don't. I don't want you having bodies out on the board just in case you still have fucking Trihorn Dragon, like in your hand. So I'll just go ahead and swing at that. And that's it. <sighs> that's not bad per se but we've gotten something a little better i'm gonna destroy your funny witch come on oh okay am i really oh my god i'm fucking out of them good oh, fuck me good not good. I'm out of a particular monster. I thought I had three in the deck. I only had two. Only two Zombiro? Yeah. Yeah. Well, that's either Jar or Bug. <laughs> um... I just need it out of my hand. <sighs> I'm gonna get rid of what we know right now. Come on, how do you still have more fucking jars? Didn't you already use one? Did you get no. two of those? I have one cyber jar and you you ha you had a cyber jar. I thought you no, I was the last duel you used the morphine jar yeah, number two. Was, yeah, yeah, that was the last game. All right, well, do your whatever. I don't fucking care anymore. My guy. Mm-hmm. This is not it. Okay. I'm gonna have to do that now. I... Okay, that's fine. <sighs> that's cool. All right, your turn. What a fun and interesting duel that we're having. Okay. 
I swear to God, this fucking card is at the bottom of my fucking deck. Wow, literally no normal summonable monsters off of that. Not a single one. Wait, how many attack points do you have? Oh, okay, cool. Yeah, that works. Yeah, I literally can't do anything. <sighs> Hooray! Don't fucking cheer. This is the least deserved victory. Two in a row that you've had. It, it's every time. Shut the fuck up. I no, love shut it. the fuck up. Oh. Okay. No, shut the fuck up. Okay. No, this is disgusting and bad and unfun in every way. You can baby rage at me all you want. I don't fucking give a shit. That was uh, I, completely unfun. No, I 100% agree, but my only other option, because I don't have as much attack power as you do. Like, you you are swimming in attack power in compared to me. My only other option as as for, like, a viable thing was Umi Beatdown. I'd rather you and, have done that because it'd be funny. And I, I ha like, my best water monsters are Amphibian Beasts and Seven Colored Fish, and that's fucking it. And Crab Turtle. That's it. Crab Turtle's funny. Yes, Crab Turtle is funny, but I would not have been able to pull off Crab Turtle because I'm pretty sure I don't have the fucking, um... I, I only have one Sonic Bird, and I don't even think I have the, the hands. Well, that sure was a duel that happened this week. It it sure was. I was desperately, desperately looking for my poly, mm -hmm. so I can fusion summon, uh, warrior, uh, last warrior from another planet. Of course, you fucking pulled that, dude. I pulled three. I have. Three what do you of mean? Them. I pulled three of them. They're all in my extra deck, dude. You're gonna shit yourself when you see my pulls. I pulled three in the. In the first half of my entire pulls. I mean, if it makes you feel any better, I almost got all of the uh, spirit board uh, letters. Fuck yourself. Are you serious? Uh, all I'm missing is the trap. Am I just missing the trap? It might just be the trap. Either the trap and one letter or just the trap. I want you to know that I got pretty much every mask. Uh, including the ritual? Not that one. Oh, okay. I didn't get Mask Beast, and I didn't get the ritual for it, but I got every, like, spell and trap mask card, pretty much. How did I you think I'm missing one. How did you not get the ritual? I got, like, four of them. I might have the the ritual spell, but I don't know oh. about the monster. Yeah, the, the, the monster I did not get. Um, yeah, my, my secrets and, and ultras for this pack were literally uh, three... Uh, three warriors of the last planet and honestly I don't even remember the rest it was uh, like the most memorable thing was the three warriors I was just like torrential 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 please please not a single one not a single fucking torrential it's like all right well Hey, I forgot to mention what we're banning. We're banning a man eater. Man, man, man eater. What the no, fuck? No, 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 no. We're banning morphing drawer number two. That's the one. Yeah. Fuck yeah, that piece of shit. Oh, well. Oh, well. What were we doing for the next set? Were we doing, uh... Well, next set, uh... By next set, there's tournament pack three. So we can pull from that also. Yeah. And, um... Next set... I believe is Legacy of Darkness. I think. Because I know that we wanted to do the the reprint sets a little early, since. Ah uh, yes, yes, yes. Uh, I, I I was suggesting like uh, w whatever order they were available in. So like oldest to newest, like yeah. Them. So. Because the reprint sets are pretty huge. We haven't reached a reprint set yet. Well, if we're going in release order, we're not going to get to Dark Beginning 1 for a while. Then let's just wait for a release order. We're not that far away. I guess, yeah. Yeah, because by the time we get to Rise of Destiny, is uh, would Dark Beginning be its own episode? Yeah. yeah? Reprint sets okay. are huge. Oh, okay. I didn't. I didn't realize. I, I thought you were saying huge, as in like. No, a huge as in they have a lot of cards. Okay, yeah, it could be its own episode. That's fine. Yeah, that's that's further down the line. 
I, I see a very funny cover card that I'm very interested in. Yeah. Uh, Soul of the Duelist. I love, I unironically love uh, the Horus, uh, the Black Flame Dragon monsters. Yeah. I hope I pull them so I don't have to continue playing this. I don't think but we're hey. getting to that yet. Oh, no, no. That's, that's like, yeah, it's a hot minute. Away. Yeah. Next is Legacy of Darkness. Legacy of Darkness is pretty. Yeah. Yep, it sure is. It sure is. Like, I'm trying to remember what's in there. Is that when Chaos comes out? Nope. No. No, Yada Lock. Yada, Yada Lock. Lock and Spirits. Yada Lock, Spirits, bad reaction to Samochi. Tyrant Dragon. Bottomless was... Trap Hole. Last turn. I don't think we should play last turn. Okay, but what if I pull it? I don't think we should play last turn. <laughs> okay, but what if I pull it? I think that we should not be trying last turn. <laughs> okay, but no, but for real time, what if I pull it? Then you're not fucking running it. Oh, okay. So is that just a waste of an ultra slot? Yeah. Oh, okay. If I pull it, I'm playing it. I'm no. fucking playing it. I mean, motherfucker, if you're going to make me waste an ultra pull, then I'm playing last turn if I pull it. <sighs> I'll be damned if you stop me. Baby, if you, all you want. If you, if, you, if you play last turn, you automatically lose the duel and I just win. And that's all it. All right, fine. Whatever. It'll be funny. <laughs> I'm going to laugh my titties off. Yeah, it'll, 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 it'll be funny. Yeah. I'm willing to forfeit that one because, hey, man. It's every time. Yeah. Through disgusting, awful ways of winning. Sure That aren't is. fun. Yep. Dub's a dub. Yeah, dub's a dub. Well, thank you all for watching this episode, I guess. Thank you for watching. We will see you next time. I hope your cat eats your eyes in your sleep. She's peed on them before. That's disgusting. <laughs> yep, it sure is.